Hello, welcome to EFT tool introduction. <clears throat> what is EFT? Unified Functional Testing. It is a functional and regression test tool from HP. UFT is an advanced version of QTP. QTP uh, stands for Quick Test Professional. UFT equal to QTP plus service tools. QTP supports <coughs> GUI testing only, but UFT supports API testing and GUI testing. Uh, UFT supports Windows operating environment only. It doesn't support Unix or Unix flavors like Linux, Solaris environments. Next, <coughs> UFT tool architecture. UFT developed in .NET technology. UFT is one tier application, desktop application. It doesn't have any database. Then how it stores its resources uh, using file format. It doesn't have any database. It stores its resources using file format on hard disk. See, primarily data has two formats. One is file format, another is tabular format. EFT stores its resources using file format. What are EFT resources? Shared object repository files, function library files, recovery scenario files, environment variable files, etc. <coughs> Next, EFT has a record and run features to design and execute tests. And it has checkpoints, output values, transaction points, etc. features for enhancing tests. UFT has integrated tools uh, for batch testing, uh, for password encoding, and for test results deletion. UFT has VB script engine to apply programming logic to our tests. It has two programming interfaces. One is UFT tool editor, another is function library. UFT has an integrated MS Access Database Engine. <coughs> Using MS Access Database Engine, it supports database testing and other data related operations. Next, object based test tool. EFT is an object based test tool. Based on front end objects only, it performs test operations. But for database testing, no front end object reference is required. Exemption is there. <coughs> Using MS Access Database Engine, UFT can communicate with any database. Software objects, example in Windows environment, window, dialog box, edit box, drop down box, list box, check box, combo box, radio button, etc. <coughs> uh, software objects in web based environment, browser, page, link, image and some are common objects suppose edit box list box button radio button combo box all these are common objects in both environments uh, windows as well as in web in uft test automation we work with four types of objects one is runtime objects next text objects Test, TEST, test objects, utility objects, and automation objects. Next, test design in UFT. UFT has a recording feature to design tests. 
or we can write tests by adding objects to object repository otherwise we can use descriptive programming for generating tests using uft tool features like checkpoints output values transaction points etc we can enhance tests otherwise we can use vb script features like uh, flow control statements functions automation objects etc we can use both uh, uft tool features as well as vb script features for enhancing tests next test execution in uft for single test run test run or test execution both are synonyms for single test run we can use run command for batch testing we can use test batch runner tool it is an integrated tool from hp for step by step execution we can use debug commands like step into step over step out etc next <coughs> integration with alm alm stands for application life cycle management it is test management tool from hp a uh, formerly quality center by installing alm add in for uft we can integrate uft tool with uh, alm project next challenges in uft test automation basically uft is object based test tool uh, sometimes it may not support it may not recognize all of our application front end objects even though we load appropriate add ins that is one of the challenge object identification is one of the major challenge in uft test automation next another challenge executing tests on various browsers like google chrome safari mozilla etc it supports but sometimes we may face problems thank you